Hi, I'm Dr. Bertice Berry, and I want to tell you a story. So tomorrow's story is do, being done today. So today was done yesterday. Anyway, um, and I love that you can kind of go through time like that by recording something and then scheduling to post. It's a pretty cool thing. If this one braid won't stay down. Okay, there we go. Okay, so I'm sitting here. I've lit my candles, I'm burning a little bit of sage, I'm starting my morning prayers, got my prayer Bible and my Bible ready. I use uh, an Oxford annotated Bible for study, just ready to do morning stuff. And I had already posted the story about, you know, sense of sound and the senses. And I was reading through the comments and, and you know, sometimes you have to read through and you stop and pray. So like those early comments, you know, are very often included in my prayers. Anyway, boy, that was a whole lot that, that is not the story, but I love it. So I came to a comment um, from Sam Benson, and he was saying how much he loved the story, yesterday's story, and how he was going to go and research himself. Literally five minutes before, I was thinking how much better we'd all be if instead of spending all the time we do searching into others' business, people's business, we would research our own self. I was just thinking that, but I didn't really have the term for it. And so I was thinking if we take a dive into our own thoughts and the why, and like something happened and I was like, why did I think that? And the outlets where my coffee maker and water filter um, are, were out, and so I had to move the water filter, and it's heavy, and I moved it, and then I moved it back, I was like, I'm gonna leave it here, because I can't stand to look at it on the counter, and then, and then it was moving, I moved it back, and I was like, well, that's crazy, because you're gonna have to turn it on again to filter more water, because you drink way more than this in the beginning of the mor morning, I was just going back and forth with that, and I just was like, why am I like this, and then I started thinking about thinking about how the presence of that water filter on the counter, the island, was more annoying to me than hefting this heavy thing back and forth. <laughs> and so I began to think about what that was and to do some, like Sam Benson said, research myself. And what I found was delightful and joyful, and it wasn't um, angry or sad. It didn't come from a place of lack. It didn't come from trauma. It was just these one of these things about myself where I like order more than I am bothered by work. <laughs> and it was fascinating. And then to sit down and read the term research myself what if we took a little bit of time in the morning to research research our own self to search our soul to search our mind to search our hearts to search our thoughts and our intentions to see why we do the thing that we do Maybe, just maybe, we won't be so bothered by what somebody else is doing. I love you.